Good afternoon everyone, Marty Barrier here and welcome back to my Soul Mask series. And yeah, the couple of last episodes we went to go uh, grab some people up here. And uh, yeah, uh, apparently I had to go back because I forgot uh, my, my archer in here somewhere. So I had to go pick him back up. That's why my waypoint is still up here. But today I want to switch up things. I think I will be trying to head up to this uh, mysterious portal. I'm not sure if I have unlocked it yet, so I will go there and double check. And then I will swing by this uh, barbarian camp, see if, if I can extract some more information from them, maybe get another point of interest somewhere. And the end goal is to actually go somewhere up here and establish a little outpost here. I think uh, it will be more of a re recruitment center if I want to knock down some people from in here, but it should also allow me to uh, actually uh, have some boxes in here and maybe go grab some copper from here because I'm pretty sure we need to get ready for uh, for uh, all the uh, iron stuff or oh, iron not iron uh, the uh, bronze stuff I need to unlock that and I need to advance a little bit so maybe at some point I can go to this ancient ruins here or heck maybe at some point go try and uh, fight the panther here for the first boss at the pyramids so that's something I need to do oh there is a question mark up here nice uh, yeah that's that's going to be the plan for today we will see how far we go I hope I can get there there then maybe here and then check for a flat location up here somewhere to build a little recruitment center and I have the usual bunch with me I have uh, the archer with me Likomas he's pretty good at arching stuff uh, then I have, I have Hammerdin yeah he's crazy he's a uh, very high level already 48 or something like that and then I have my monk which should be a uh, gauntlet person so I'm gonna bring those back and additionally let me show you I also prepared a lot of materials so walls uh, stairs roofs doors ceilings um, foundations and whatnot and wait that's going to be used for uh, creating the uh, outpost up there recruitment center oh yeah and if I find a female copybearer I'll have to go get on because apparently I still didn't get a female one. I thought I did in one of the previous episodes, but it looks like it's not there anymore. So there is a crocodile up there. I'm trying to get past that and now the ruin should be up there. I think I already unlocked it, but I just want to go and double check just to be sure. Uh, I don't want to have to travel back in the one of the next coming episodes to, uh, to this place because I didn't unlock it. Crap, how did I get up top again? Oh yeah, I need to go the other way around. Because that, that means I probably might be encountering some uh, some pasties. Maybe it's better if I jump off the uh, alpaca and uh, yeah, make it follow me. Because yes, as you can see, I made a saddle for my alpaca. Makes traveling a little bit easier. Although right now it's kind of overloaded with all the stuff I put in it. But yeah, it should allow me to travel a little bit faster at least. And... If I get to the copper mine, I should be able to bring some resources with me. So here we are at the portal. Let's check if I haven't locked it. Yeah, I already did. I see it's already shining with a blue light. So let me just double check to be sure. But, but pigs, hey, ah, following us. Okay. Dead pigs. Uh, I gave everyone some food. Yeah, I did. I did already. Oh, and I uh, wait, I unlocked this one already too. So I can actually teleport from this one to that one. Nice. Okay, so that's good to know. Uh, let's take the alpaca and then mark this spot on the map and bring the alpaca there or mount the alpaca and get go other way. Right, right. Keys, keys, keys. Okay, uh, let's go um, check that spot as well. And I hope uh, I don't kill the, uh, the scout in one hit because I do really want to extract more information out of them so they uh, unlock some more points of interest for us to go visit at some point. Are you all coming with me? Oh yeah, they are. Just takes a while. Okay, so let's check. Uh, we should be getting close. I think I'm probably going to put everybody on passive again because uh, if if hammered in... Oh, wait, what's happening? Ooh. Ooh. An elite panther. Uh, what would happen if I sent everyone in? <laughs> Wait, let me quickly grab some food while I think of it. So this is fruit and veggies. What does it give me? 
some uh, hydration this is also this is nice meat for now this is nice uh, staple food for now yes and this fruit and vegetables uh, yeah recovery and stamina regen sure let's do that too so I have one two three this is also meat and this one is also fruits and vegetables so I have everything I should be having okay let's let's give this a try uh, send everyone in <coughs> aim with the bow <gasps> yep. he already hit me pretty bad yeah. Jesus come on hit it get it off me okay nice I can get a heal off maybe. Jesus, he's strong. Need to keep facing it, just to be sure. Should try to get another uh, heal off if possible. I think they stunned it. He's trying to hunt me down. Okay, time for a... Oh, crap! I said time for a... No bueno, no bueno. I'm effing dead. Will they kill it? Oh. Let me uh, respawn as hammer. This is not a good start of this episode. Uh, the character of Hamadin is not the original character. Would you like to revive and control this? Yeah. You know what? I could as well respawn at my campfire and walk back, I think. Yeah. Respawn at bonfire, walk back. It will be a lot easier than uh, taking control of Hamadin. Well, that's not a good start of the episode, but yeah. This way, you guys know that bad things happen. Especially to me, of course. Uh, of course, if I don't encounter one bush dog or one crocodile, I'll be dead again. One piranha. Yeah, okay. Didn't think of the piranhas. Hmm, I need to go back up there and get my stuff back. Oh, crocodile, yeah. oh no, it's a, a tapir or whatever it's called. Let's try to work our way back to the elite spawn. Wait, he hit me pretty darn hard. I should not have done this. Can I climb up there? I hope I can. Sometimes you can't. Okay, I can. Nice. Come on, get up there, so my people don't die due to the tiger respawning, or the panther respawning, actually. Quick reball, what is that? Is that a debuff or something? I never noticed you get a debuff, debuff when uh, reviving, actually. Anyway, I should be able to get to back to my, uh, to my stuff. It was not very smart to start a heal at that moment. I should have waited until my uh, my cream or whatever was ready and then used that actually. Hold on, I'm almost back guys. I will be picking up all my stuff. Just survive a little longer. My alpaca is still alive. My friends did kill it. But uh, yeah, I got killed in the process. No worries, I'm back. I will take all my stuff back. I will deploy you. Don't forget to redeploy them after you die because sometimes I forget that and then only a couple of minutes later I notice that, well, my people are not following me. There are a lot of bones here, so let's get the bones out of the way. Bring the alpaca with me. Can I iron it? Oh no, I can't. Okay. Get the meat and the stuff. The bones, yes, let's try to pick them all up. There are sometimes some uh, elite bones here, so it's always interesting to pick those up. Why did I die now? So, it's probably some miscalculation from my side. There's nothing else up here. I kind of hoped I would have uh, gotten a little, uh, what's it called, a little plaque up here, but sadly, not here. Okay, so, zero death. It's no longer a thing. Oh, wait, there's a, a big hole up here. Why? Why? Look, now I'm stuck. Okay, 
Let's jump off here. You don't want to jump off here? Okay. Okay, I was almost, almost, almost. Of course, now I get damaged again. I think everyone should still be following me. You are top here or whatever. I hope everyone is still following me. Wait, did I whistle my pocket to follow me? Yeah, he is with me, but I can't see him. Oh, he's between the other guys. Whew. I thought I had forgotten my alpaca. Luckily, I just did. Okay, piggies. Those are no problem. I want some too. Okay, done. Now let's try to get a little bit closer to the scout camp. Push talk. Mm -hmm. Should be pretty close now. Yeah, 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 I am close. I know this place. So let's try to put everyone on passive somewhere up here. Do not follow me. So F3 and F6. And leave the alpaca here too. Try to get one with a bow. Is there actually anything worth getting? No. This is a barbarian. That's the scout, that's the one I need to deter. So let's try to do the sneaky way. Wait, it's the scout I hit. Time. Now I could normally get in safely and try to hit it once and then put away my weapon. Oh, oh. Already? One hit? Jesus, I need to be careful. Okay, I deterred it. Did he give me anything? I don't think he did. Wait, I killed the wrong guy before? I did. Let's place a marker up here and work our way up there then. Uh, at least I got some green crystals out of this. Not even that. Okay. <laughs> ah, okay, everyone come and follow me please. Two and a five. There you go. Let's head up to that place up there and see what we can find. Nine, meanwhile, of course, night has fallen. I think that other spot is a little uh, ruin with some bush dogs in it. I'm not 100% sure, but I believe I have been there in my other place played through. Also, I probably will be mixing in some... Um, wait a minute, what's that? Oh, it's that uh, the piggies I just killed. I will probably be mixing in some build videos from the other server, uh, our community server. We have a couple of players, people playing on there, friends from community and stuff like that. And I did already do a couple of builds up there, so I might uh, actually record an episode or two on there. So you can see the things that we have built up there. I'm pretty proud of one of my build projects up there. It's a big pyramid. It's way too big. But I'm happy with the results. So no complaints there. Check what that is at some point. Oh, wait, this is clay again. Oh, alligator. Yeah, let's go kill it. <clears throat> Cut it up. Oh yeah, yeah, look, this is a place I didn't bring one of those uh, 
firefly catching things with me, I think. Let me check, actually. No, I do not have a firefly catching thing with me. But this is actually where you could uh, get, catch the fireflies for your firefly lanterns and stuff like that. Just swing around with your net up here and you will grab some. What are you? A tapir? Male, female? Turkey, okay. I don't, I don't eat any more turkeys for now. I think I have enough turkeys. Of course, it's dark again. Luckily, my friends are carrying some lanterns, so they are probably gonna light one. Okay, we are almost there. What is this? Wait, this looks like something too. Of course, put away your... Or am I mistaken? I'm mistaken. There's nothing to see up here. Some more piggies, I guess. are dead too. So what ooh, is cold camp? Yeah. Okay, let's try to put everyone on passive again. Tell the alpaca not to follow me and try to sneak up on some of them. So ooh, nice barbarian actually. What is this? This is a scout. I don't need that one. Is that one I need to kill first? So let's try. Moved. Okay, let them come closer, that's fine. No, 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 not that crap. He didn't drop anything or what? Oh, here it is. Okay, so now I need to get rid of the dog. If I can. What's happening up here? Don't want, don't want to get killed. Dog should be dead. I hope I don't want to hit this guy again. No. Crap. Okay, this time I got him. Exploration point information received. Now I can safely kill him. That's fine. Get all the stuff. Get all this stuff. And move up a little bit. Wait, so what did he give me actually? Oh, a question mark way up there, I guess? Yeah, this one I already had. Oh, there is one up here too now. Okay. But yeah, uh, we have arrived here, so it's time to actually try to find a place for us to set up a little camp. Uh, you can both follow me again. Alpaca can follow me again. I think the base is actually... This is flat area, I believe. Because on our server someone someone built something up here and... Hold on, I need to be... I need to watch out because there is actually a lot of aloe up here. I don't see it right now, but once you spot it, you will know that it's aloe. Where are you? Push dogs? More push dogs? There's no one. Okay. Push dog 
looks gone. And now let's check. I think this area seems to be reasonably flat. And the camp... Oh, there's my bows. Okay, let's get the bows. Bows are dead. Why do you do that? Yeah, I think this is a reasonably flat area. There's some herbs here, but that doesn't really matter. But there is. If I can find it, there are a couple of patches of... Oh, look here. This is aloe. You can quickly see it once you know what to look for. So let me show you. If I put this on my hotbar, you will see these plants here. Aloe. This one, aloe. This one, aloe. And there was a couple of patches up here, so maybe I should not destroy those. How far am I actually from the camp? Oh, that's the camp up there. Okay, let's try to move up a, a little bit uh, somewhere in this area might do. So, yeah, Mr. Alpaca, you should not be following me anymore. Give me actually, yeah, of course, do not do, not do that. Um, yeah, I think up there should be a good idea. So view items. Let's first pick up some of those foundations. Um, I'm going to be building something very simple, something, something circular. Um, why? Because it's easy to put the bonfire inside of that. Wait, did I bring the bonfire? I might have forgotten the bonfire, actually. So let's try to have something maybe up here. Seems building recommended to play. Okay, okay, I don't care about that. Let's try to get the lines right. Okay, this is perfect. And now to make it a little bit uh, circular, I will be adding squares on the triangles and triangles on the squares. Other places in between. You guys, come here. Okay, and stop following, please. Just for a minute. Wait, pigs. Okay. Another one. Okay. Okay, that's that. Now I can extend the building a little bit more and I think one more section of um, walls and foundation should do. For now at least. I think after a while we will be able to expand it again. Get the lines a little bit the way I like them to go. Oh, that one is still correct. Okay. Uh, okay. And then okay. And then okay. And this one should be okay to I think all the lines are going correctly okay if if I want to expand that a little bit more I simply add triangles on the squares and squares on the triangles and I will have to fill it up of course yeah like this so like that I'll have to get rid of that stone, doesn't matter. I can do that in a minute. So this one might be a little bit boring, but we need a little base of operation here to, uh, to start something. Okay, and then squares where there's room left. Preferably with the lines going in the direction I want them to go. Okay, I need to get rid of that stone. Okay, no problem, no problem. I can do that. There you go. Stone gun. Let's place the last couple of foundations. Apparently, I brought way too many foundations and stuff. But that doesn't matter. We can always leave them here and maybe use them later on to extend the area. Did, now, the question is, did I bring the bonfire? And where did my alpaca go? Wait a minute. Oh, there. Let's bring the alpaca a little bit closer. Jump on it. Okay, drive a little bit closer. Can you get on there? Would be nice. You can't. Okay, I need stairs. That's what I thought. So let me check if I brought the uh, bonfire with me. 
I knew I had forgotten something. <sighs> well, okay, let's place the uh, walls in and I will go pick up the, uh, the bonfire later on. So what will be the entrance and the exit? I think the camp is up there, yes. So this should be an entrance and an exit so let's place a door up there first because i still have one from the last time there i want double doors and now let's place the walls so the walls are up here okay seven i want double doors on this side and i might want double doors on that side as well let's say where's base oh there is base okay on this side double doors and the rest can all be Actually, do I want to... Maybe here it's safer to have walls. So they don't see inside or something like that. Wall. Wall. And then this could be windows. Wall. Wall. So let's have walls on, on the squares. And windows in all other spots. Okay, should be it. Think. Okay, I, I probably I didn't bring any doors. Go figure. Uh, so view items. I will be placing some more foundations actually. But the walls I do not need, or I should be making it too high. But I don't feel like making it too high. Ah oh, crap! See, I forgot more things. I forgot my roofs as well. I did bring some doors. That's nice. You can go in here. So let's place some doors. And I thought I brought some, uh, some uh, what's it called, some uh, railings and stuff. Okay, it's closed up. That's good. Open it up. Check the alpaca. A few items. Get rid of this. I don't need that anymore. I will be picking up some more foundations, of course, because I want to add an extra layer to this. So this is squares, and as I mentioned already, extend the squares with... Uh, this is a triangle, extend triangles with squares, I mean. So this will be triangles, and this will be... I'm not explaining it correctly, I think. What I mean is, if the inside is a triangle, then here should be a square. So you guys, uh, follow me just a little bit. So get out of the way. Okay, now you can relax again. So seven. This is actually a square. Inside this here a triangle. So these two need to be squares. Indoors this is a triangle. Outdoors these should be squares. Indoors this is a triangle. So this one should be a square. I will be putting triangles, so this one should be squares. Okay, and now I can switch to triangles and put those in. Okay, something like this. Then we have a little walkway outside too. It doesn't have to be pretty here, but yeah, maybe they will like it. Who knows? Something like that. Okay, uh, actually... We will have to skip the rest to the next episode because this one will be already way too long. Okay, that's fine. With me dying. Yeah. A little setback up there. Uh, yeah, like that. And you can go in there. You can go like this. And you can go like this as well. I think that's done. Yes, it looks like it's done. So let me get the alpaca, put up some... Oh, you know what? I could actually... If I have enough, I could put stairs all around. Maybe that would look nice. I'm not sure. So did I bring stairs? I did bring some stairs. Okay. Let's try. The stairs on the places where we have doors first. You and you. Yeah, there are doors up here as well. Wait, where are the doors? Did I mess up? No, here are the... No, they are not. Here are the doors. And the question is, can you now actually... Uh, 
Is that what I want? Hmm. Might not be what I was thinking of. I was thinking of filling everything up with stairs, but I'm kind of afraid they will be getting stuck. You know what? I can try. I'm afraid people will get stuck on that, but okay, doesn't matter. Okay, I don't even have enough stairs. Perfect, but at least we can get up. And now I will be putting some fences around it, and that's going to be it for today, I think. A few items, fences. Okay, place some fences. Perfect. And let's place the fences somewhere like this. I know that this makes the whole stairs around it a little bit obsolete, but this is open, open. Stairs. Let's try to have this one open, open too, on uh, the next set of squares. So this one, ah crap. That's why it's better to bring a building hammer actually, then you can simply pick everything back up with a simple right click, or a middle mouse button click or whatever. Makes it a little bit easier than having to wait for the uh, box to disappear. You know what, let's finish it up with some like this then everything will be nice and pretty and oh crap well actually huh oh yeah I, I don't really mind that so where we have the real stairs actually at the second setting I don't really mind that actually. Okay, you I can't make you because I don't have any stuff yet. Okay, um you know what? I'm gonna bring the alpaca inside and do the rest a little bit off camera, finish up the build, go back to the old base and grab the, uh, what's it called, the, the roofs and the um, bonfire and bring everything back up here. Now you can follow me again and go inside at least. There you go. Okay, now stay here everyone. And I will be signing off at the new little camp spot. You know what, let's jump on the, on the stone, okay. Anyway guys, this is uh, the beginnings of the new base, the new little outpost, probably recruitment center and a drop-off point for uh, copper and stuff like that. This is not going to be a main base, it's just for collection purposes. Anyway, uh, this will be it for today, I hope you enjoyed it and if you did, let me know in the comment section be below, give me a little thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel would also be nice, it helps uh, the YouTube algorithm and until next time, have fun and stay safe. Goodbye everyone.